Now presenting Banana Phobia by Jessica Morgan and Jenny Schmidt. So have you always had a fear of bananas? Well, I always used to love bananas, but my whole room was covered with bananas, but I just can't be around them anymore. I can hardly say the word, but... Yeah. So when did your phobia of bananas start? Sorry, I didn't mean to get that emotional. It all started when I when I tripped on a banana peel. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! What types of symptoms have you experienced? Whenever I see a banana, I break down inside. I just... I can't handle it. I break down, I have hot flashes, and I run out of the room if I see one. I, it, it's ruining my life! I believe I have the perfect solution for you. Using a type of behavior therapy called classical conditioning, I will help you overcome your phobia and correct these unwanted behaviors and symptoms. To show you that you shouldn't be afraid of bananas, I'm going to show you this video of this really cute fluffy bunny who's eating a banana to show you that you shouldn't be afraid of bananas either. It is kind of cute. Oh, look at that I'm going to show you a fun song of a dancing banana to show you that not all bananas are threatening. conditioning, I like to associate nice things with bananas. Mm. I like banana bread. It tastes good and it smells good and you can't slip on it. What do I want to do with it? I smell it? It's banana! It actually does kind of smell good. <sighs> There we I know go. you used to love bananas, and I feel like after all of this classical conditioning and you coming to terms with your fears and overcoming them, that now you can encounter a banana and enjoy it again. Looks like my work here is done. Thank you for watching Banana Phobia.